Hey guys, Steve here from the Cook Family Homestead and if you can see behind me, I have a nice plot tilled up and what we're going to do is we're going to plant some late season field corn for, for hunting for the deer. And I wanted to show you this Earthway planter. It's a pretty neat little uh, machine here and this thing is made in the United States, been around for years and years. And uh, I want to show you how this works. What, what it does is it comes with these plates in here. It's very light too, if you can see. But it comes with these discs here. It comes with six different ones, depending on what seed. This is for corn. And as you go, it picks the seeds up like that. You fill this hopper up and then it drops it down in here. And this is actually plowing a groove as you go. You can set it, have it set for an inch and uh, it will drop the seed in. This chain comes behind it and pushes the dirt back over and then your rear tire kind of flattens it out. So it does everything all at once. Another neat feature that has this, and as you're going down the row, you drop that down and it makes a groove as you go. So when you come back, you follow that groove for your next row. And then you can swing it over as you turn. So it's a pretty neat little uh, planner here. Saves your back. And we're going to see how quick we can do this whole thing. It's a pretty decent size uh, lot. So what I got here is some field corn, if you can see here. And we're going to just fill this hopper and uh, we're gonna get some corn planted. All right, so what happens is if you see this plate in here, it will pick one up and if you can watch, it will fall out the bottom as you go. And it's supposed to do it every seven inches. I have this overfilled probably. So let's give it a try Well, we are all planted. Got about 12 rows, I think, well, maybe 13 rows planted. And uh, this thing <laughs> saves you a lot of time. Probably did it all in about 20 minutes. A uh, Couple pointers on this. So if you're looking to get this, first of all, it, it works really good. But one of the things is when you're filling the hopper here, if you can see there's a hole right there, that goes out the side. It actually drops the seed in this hole right here. That one, if you overfill it, it will kick some seeds out to, over the side. So I'm gonna keep it lower than that hole. Um, and also I set the depth about a half inch instead of an inch and it seemed to work really good. On the outer edges of the tilled plot here, it's pretty clumpy. So that was a little tough to get through, but the middle section was, it worked phenomenal. So, um, you know, if the more fluffier, I guess you could say the dirt is more uh, tilled up, it's gonna work a lot better, so. Uh, but that thing worked great. Uh, it saved me a lot of time. Like I said, 20 minutes. Can you imagine hoeing rows through here and dropping them in by hand? That'll take you forever. You can just walk right down at a decent pace. And it seemed to work pretty good. Like I said, the clump was a little challenge, but they do make a knockoff version of this. And it was about a hundred bucks and it just didn't have great reviews. And this one's been around a long time. And I know some other homesteaders that uh, have given it pretty good thumbs up that I trust. Um, Stony Ridge Farmer, you know, gave it a good thumbs up and that's pretty good enough for me. But um, so I'm built in the US and uh, backed up too, as far as warranty. So 
pretty nice little planner saves you a lot of time and energy so two thumbs up so we'll see how this grows i'll do a update here in a in a, probably like a month or a month and a half maybe two months and then we'll once it matures and hopefully you'll see me arrow on a deer with the stand that i'm going to be putting right in that corner and uh see how it goes so thanks for watching and god bless y'all